Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all having a fabulous day. So today's video is going to be a little bit chatty, although I did speed it up a little bit. That's why I'm doing a voiceover today, because I could not decide what I wanted to do for my birthday week at all. Like, I originally was going to buy an Etsy kit, and I'm kind of talking about that here, but then I decided, actually, I didn't even decide. I, like, completely forgot that my birthday was this week, and I hadn't ordered anything, and so I was like, well, that's not going to work. So I just pulled out my color storybook, and I was just kind of flipping through there and just trying to figure out kind of what I wanted to go with. Um, I really wanted to go with a black and white theme, which seems kind of boring, I know, but it was just, like calling to me and I just really really wanted it so I think of what that's what I ended up deciding to do is a black and white thing but I did flip through like all of my books for a while you guys <laughs> like a good like almost three minutes worth of me just flipping through several different books so I flipped through the color story book I think I flipped through um one of the older books with the green cover you'll see that in a second um and then I just kept flipping through books. I did want to use that quote right there, which just says, the best is yet to come. I thought it was perfect because it is my birthday week, and I am turning 25, and it was just kind of a reminder that the best is coming, guys, so simmer down, Taylor. <laughs> also, did you notice that I did not use my spread last week at all? I know. Bad YouTuber. Zooming in. <laughs> so I'm about to put down the full box in the corner. And I'm just using the best is yet to come box. And what I decided to do for this spread is kind of do the best of both worlds. So I'm going to be using some of my classic like black and white stickers with some teal accents. And I just showed you guys my cold brew coffee. If you follow me on Snapchat or Instagram, that's Zazzle in the background. I have been talking about this cold brew like crazy. And I am obsessed with it, you guys. It is so so delicious. So I just pulled a coffee sticker and I didn't realize this was out of frame. Oh my goodness. Um, and I'm just talking about putting the checklist because it kind of matches with the full box. So I'm just talking about that there. But I just put a cute little coffee sticker down and I'm trying to find a quote sticker that I want to use for that um, little area. Because I thought a quote sticker would be really perfect to kind of put down right there. And then it's a little too big for the coffee cup. So I did peel it back up and then place the coffee cup back on top of it. And I really didn't think that these uh, clear stickers would peel up that easily. But this one actually peeled up pretty dang good. So whoop whoop for that. I was very, very impressed. Then the next thing I'm going to put down is just one of those teal checklists. In the middle section because you always have a lot to do on a Monday I mean come on it's a Monday for goodness sakes and I'm just trying to straighten it out because there's nothing that bothers me more than when I can't have that checklist in a straight line like it's one of my pet peeves in life and then now I'm about to put down just a regular black full box it was a black and white I didn't want to put too many quotes because I kind of felt like I was putting too many quotes down um, so I was trying to find something that was just kind of plain. And then I did just put a gold star down. That is to mark my videos, obviously. I only put up two videos last week. And I'm really hoping to get three up this week. But if not, you'll definitely get two up. Um, two seems to be the magic number lately. I mean, there for a while it was three. But apparently it's not three anymore. <laughs> we are doing the best that we can with what we got. Okay, guys? Y'all know I'm working a lot of hours, so I know you understand, and I know you're not upset with me, but we'll at least try for two. I just put down a little to-do box, and I've talked about these boxes for, like, ever, but I absolutely love them. I love the grid pattern, and it just makes making lists on them so easy. Um, and then I put a Find Your Happy sticker across the two sections and then I actually put a checklist on Wednesday down at the bottom and then I left the top box blank besides one of the little gold stars I know I'm not showing you guys that but I did leave it blank besides the little gold star um, and that's just because I kind of liked how empty it was I like adding things as I go instead of making it so like crazy so that's when I decided to do there 
just to kind of keep all the pizzazz going. Um, and I'm trying to decide do I want to leave it blank or I don't, but I like, I like the idea of it being blank and just having a little more open because I find the weeks that I do put more stuff there that I actually don't use the spread. Um, so I've been trying to leave it a little more blank. Now for the weekend, I'm putting kind of like a comical box across Saturday and Sunday and I just think it's really, really funny, you guys. So it is a full box that says adulting is hard because I'm having a really hard time with turning um, 25. I don't really want to be 25, but of course I don't really have a say so in the matter. And so I'm just kind of having a hard time with the fact that um, I am going to be 25. And so I was like, that's going to be a little comical. I'm all about irony. So we put that down. And then right underneath that, um, I put down such an amazing weekend because it is my birthday weekend. And so it is going to be a good weekend regardless. It's just going to be like, I'm turning 25. I feel so freaking old, you guys. So freaking old. So I am putting, decorating uh, the Sunday, which is my birthday, July 23rd. Boop, boop. Um, I'm putting some cake stickers down and a birthday sticker. All of this is in the mom planner book. I actually really love the scripts and everything for these birthday stickers. And I love the little cake. And then I just put a little sticker down that says happy day. And I'm just putting little confetti stickers all across, which is so awesome, you guys. I'm super excited about that. Um, I don't really know what I'm doing for my birthday. Honestly, for my birthday this year, I just really want to chill. And so I'm planning to do like, um, as you'll see in a second, I'm doing like laundry on Thursday because like for the whole weekend, like I just want to relax. I haven't had a like relaxing weekend in a while. So I just want to relax for my birthday. Um, this quote is actually one of my favorite quotes in the whole wide world. And it says, change your thoughts and you'll change the world. And I truly believe that. And I've been saving this sticker for so long because I just really, really wanted to put that sticker in a spread. And I thought this is perfect for my birthday. I truly honestly believe that if we did change the thoughts, um, our thoughts and loved more and when we're open and accepting to people that this world would be completely differently and I really do try to live my life that way I try to live my life as a very non-judgmental person because I just feel like of all the things in the world somebody else judging somebody else is just not something else we need we have so much of that and I just really, really love this quote. Like, I, I love it so much. So, I, of course, had to use that. And I'm just putting checklists down for Friday. And I do plan on leaving most of Thursday and Friday blank. Um, because I don't really know what's going to be going on. I don't know if I'm going out Friday night. Or if I may just, like, go to lunch or brunch or something. I don't know. Something super basic. I just put a jot it down sticker underneath that checklist just to add some little decoration to it because I thought it'd be super festive. Um, and then up at the top, I'm just going to do a little coffee sticker because it is Friday and that's one of my favorite days to have coffee. Um, Friday and Mondays are like my treat days so like I can go to Dunkin' Donuts and I can go to Starbucks. And then the curly cue on this one just ended really bad like it was not pretty at all I'm kind of glad you can't see it <laughs> you'll see it when I show you this full spread though but it was not cute at all you guys at all so I'm just going to put the laundry sticker down like I said earlier um so I could do laundry on Thursday because I don't really want to do anything on the weekend like I want to have it completely open so if I want to like literally binge watch Netflix all weekend I could binge watch Netflix and no one would judge me for it. Well, I'm sure some people would judge me, but I don't care because it's my birthday and I can do what I want to do. <laughs> so, boom, there is that. And just so you guys know, Zazzle wants to talk so much, but I will not let him because I'm doing this voiceover. <laughs> so for Saturday, I just put a grocery list down and a to buy checklist. And then over here on the sidebar, I think the thing, the only thing I decided to track was my social media. I flipped through a couple of my um, 
Etsy stickers, Paper Lou Boutique, and I just decided to end up just writing everything in because I couldn't really find anything that kind of matched this teal. It's a very different teal color. It's not like most of the colors out there. So I couldn't find anything to match it. So I ended up just putting down whatever I can find, which was um, just me writing in pen and then adding a laptop. So you'll see me do that in a second. I was trying to find some different quotes and stuff like that to kind of put down over this bottom box with the black and white too because I just felt it was a little too plain. So I was over here trying to fumble through everything to find everything or to find a quote that matched. Like I literally went through every single sticker book that I owned to try and find something and I could just not find it. Like I told you guys, I was just in a weird planning mood and that's why I decided to do a voiceover because I was like, this is a 20 minute video and me basically just flipping through sticker books because I could not decide what I wanted and no one likes watching that. <laughs> At least I don't anyway. <laughs> I don't like watching it. That's for sure. But that's literally all I'm doing here. It's just flipping through sticker books. And that's why you can't really see anything on screen. Because that's all I'm doing. It's just flipping through sticker books. And so I kind of took them out of frame. Because I was like, I cannot find anything I like. And I finally found a quote that I really like in the um, quote sticker book. Which that is seriously one of my favorite books ever, you guys. Like, I love it so much and I'm going to show you guys in just a second what that looks like it is so pretty and it's kind of yellow so it doesn't really match but I like the quote so I used it and it says shine so bright that they can't look away which is something I really try to do is I try to be so um not like in your face because no one likes to know it all that's in your face but I just try to do the best that I can and I try to work really hard and do all that I can so that I am noticed because for a long time I just assumed I would never get noticed by anyone in upper management or for careers or anything like that and that's one of the things I have learned in my life is to take chances and to do everything in your power to you know look so bright that they literally cannot look away so that's something now that I really try to emulate and just do in my life because I think it's important. I don't know. Maybe I'm just talking outside of my head. That could also be what I'm doing. So I'm just writing down the social media. And I'm going to put a cute little laptop there. That is from the Paperly Boutique. Um, she's one of my favorite shops. I'll leave her linked down below. And then these two icon stickers are actually from a shop that is no longer open. It's called Even Layers. I actually checked a couple weeks ago when I used them on Etsy and they are not there anymore. And I'm just showing you a close up because they're super washed out on that white paper. They are very, very light gray and you could barely see them. So I was like, I should probably show the people what it really looks like. And then I did put a hump day sticker down and that is from Cricut Paper Company. And then I am putting a to film sticker down from the Paperly Boutique. So I can put my video filming checklist down below. And then that is really going to be everything you guys. I'm not doing too many other things in the spread. Here in a second I'm about to show you the full spread for the week because that was just really everything. It looks very thrown together but I don't hate it at the same time. So... I don't really know. I was in a weird mood about filming this and I'm still glad I did because I need to put some videos up for you guys. I've been feeling like I'm super lacking lately and I'm so sorry about that. I've just had so much stuff going on that I haven't really taken the time to be present on social media and present on YouTube and just putting my all into it because I'm just feeling so strapped at work and putting my all into that. So I'm sorry you guys. I'm really, really sorry. Um, before I show you the full spread, I'm actually going to get some gold glitter washi. And I'm going to washi down the bottoms. I didn't do this on camera because it's really hard to put washi down. And I was like, I just didn't really feel like doing that. But that was actually the very last part of my gold washi, which is perfect because I've literally had that for two years. Two years to go through that washi. And if you know how many times I've used it, 
that's pretty dang impressive. If I do say so myself. Say so myself. Words are hard. So this is my full spread, you guys. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. I had so much fun filming it for you. If you enjoyed it, give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Be sure to enter the link down below for the giveaway for personal planner to win your own personal planner. It'll be linked down below. And if you have any other questions, be sure to comment in the comment section. I love you guys. Oodles and noodles. And I'll check you next time.